nice town. And all those things, all my positive, like, you know, you have a great meal, okay, all sorts of dishes. And in the end, you have something, uh, you get some really dirty thing in your mouth. Now you forget about all the good things and this bad taste remains, right? So that is exactly what happened with me. The taste in mouth was bad because of that accident. Awful, awful thing. The thing is that she didn't get very badly injured or something. She will recover. In two, three days, she will be fine. She will start going back to work. But it, it feels very bad that, you know, I did this. Is on what happened. Very, very bad feeling. Hmm. This is a topic for, you know, those people who, um, you know, have uh, the gift of, you know, glib, those glib people, you know, uh, they have something to say on any topic. I don't think I can answer that question in any, in any very special way. Um, because I'm myself guilty of this. If I knew, then why wouldn't I stop, you know? Some people are born that way. They can't help it. Some are carefree people. They don't care about anything anyone says, anyone does. You know, they're so relaxed. And some people can't be that way. Virendra Sehwag didn't bother himself at all when he got out. He just good evening, played sir. a shot. Hello, Sarita. Good evening. He played a shot, got a boundary. Great. Got out. All right. Rahul Dravid didn't, could not could not be that way. He said a couple of times he tried to be like him. Uh, it didn't work for him. So if you are one of those people who is guilty of overthinking, then the only thing is try and find reasons behind your ideas, th thoughts. If you have a thought without a reason, try and get rid of the, the thought. Just convince yourself. I don't know. There isn't a solution in my mind. It happens sometimes. I also overthink. But what I have fever? What? That I've never heard of. Yes, sir. I, you know, I have headache sometimes. Then it is not just overthinking. It has gone beyond that line. It has become something else. Overthinking is such a typical typical trait uh, a lot of people are guilty of overthinking but they don't develop a fever they don't have a, a headache because of that so what were you overthinking about by the way your marriage no. I, I don't study well. I don't uh, when did you realize that you were not studying very well Somewhere you have to realize that I'm not studying very well. When did you get that feeling that you're not studying very well? When I start preparing for a job, I like I'm not for this. You need you need a psychologist, a career counselor who can help you. How did you decide you are not good enough to get a government job or something? Um, I, I should leave this and start How that. did you come to that conclusion that you know it's not your thing? You can't get a government job. Who is stopping you? Who is stopping? You? You don't want to study, then it's your choice, then you can definitely leave. Why don't you want to study? Because you don't enjoy it. 
right. All right. All right. Sometimes we have to do the. We have to. There is a nice phrase with hard yard. Hard yard. Do the hard yards. We have to do the hard yards. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Yes. Make the hard yards. Sometimes we, uh, we need to make hard yards. Good evening. Sometimes you have to make the hard yards. It means sometimes you have to do extra work. Whether you like it or not, life is like that. You know, and if you are staying away from, as a student, you never realized you were not very good. Who said hello to me? Sakib. I said good evening, sir. You said good evening. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. So some students have taken an extra day off without my informing them. At the afternoon, in afternoon, Adnan, he you. Uh, actually, I told uh, Ashya and told my mom, Katie, what's going on. Adnan, from Baradari. Tall Adnan. Yeah. Mm. No, you guys could take confidence from the fact that I inform when I have to go absent. And if I didn't say anything about today, then clearly the class was on. That's very basic, simple. Because you notice that I informed you, right? Mm, I'm very excited to start a new unit. But before that, we'll have to finish the previous unit completely. Story. Narrative story, yeah? Yeah, yeah, right. Let's do this. And in the practice, we have already finished everything, I guess, yeah. suppose. Good evening. Uh, it's okay. It's clear. And that's what matters. It's clear. You didn't write much when you were a child? I wrote much. You wrote a lot. I wrote a lot of care. Hmm. Nice. So, I think, uh, my dad had some problem at hmm. uh, and his little what is that? Trembles. Yeah, and I have I think I have the same little. Okay. Okay. But your handwriting is very clear. I have no problems with reading it. Could you turn on the lights, Aman? Did you guys read everybody's text, everybody's story? My Aunt Camila's portrait. I would like you guys to read your uh, text yourself in your voice, okay? Okay, everybody? Go ahead. Start. Who will read first? Sahil, do you want to start, Sahil? Yes, sir. Go ahead. Please, sir, give me a minute, sir. Okay, then, until then, I could listen to Sora, maybe. Sora, do you want to read, Sora? Can you hear me, sir, clearly? You have to read the text. You have to just read it. Hello, sir. Yes, yes, sir. So, I'm going to start reading. My aunt Camilla was an old and very interesting lady. One day when she saw herself in the mirror, she got passionate about herself and suddenly she decided to make a portrait of herself from a world-famous painter. Immediately, she went to world-famous portrait painter, Joel Unwin. The second. 
twice a week she visited his studio. Tolk made her portrait and he didn't want her to see the picture until it is totally finished. Finally, the portrait was ready and my aunt Camilla excited and hurried to see the portrait exactly like my aunt. Unfortunately, she didn't like it and refused to accept herself the way she was. She ordered him to make a beautiful picture. This time, she didn't visit the studio. After another month, the portrait was ready and it wasn't my aunt. It was a beautiful girl and my aunt liked it very much and she paid the painters some extra money. Beautiful. Well done, Sarah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, please. Okay. Uh, Sahil, are you ready now? Yes, sir. Yes. Yes, sir. My Aunt Camilla was an old and very stubborn. One day, she looked herself in the mirror and suddenly she decided that she needed a portrait of herself. And then immediately she made call the world-famous portrait painter Rolf Unwin. Twice a week, she went to she went to his studio. Rolf has Rolf hasn't painted her portrait. He did not want to see the picture until it's complete. But excuse me, excuse me, Sahil, can you go yes. back one sentence and read again slowly? He did not want to see the picture. He did not want to one see... sentence before that. One sentence before that. Rolf hasn't painted her portrait. What does that Rolf hasn't? No, did not, sir. Okay, I'm take here. Yes, sir. So Rolf did not paint her portrait. Fine, uh, uh, part three. Finally, after some days, the portrait got ready. My aunt was excited and 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 her. Hurried because the mm -hmm. because the portrait was exactly like my aunt. Unfortunately, she didn't she didn't like and refused. She got angry. She ordered him to make another one. Part four. This time, this time she did not visit the visit at the studio. But after another couple of months, she her portrait was ready, and my aunt was very happy to see it. The face wasn't beauty. The face was very beautiful, but not like my aunt. But however, my she looked it and she she loved it and she paid uh, paid Rolf money in a happy mood in a good way. Very nice. There were a few mistakes which I'm going to talk about a bit later. First of all, I would like to hear everybody. So, who's gonna read next? Aman, do you want to? Okay. My aunt Camila is an old lady. One day she saw in the mirror herself. Suddenly she decided that have a portrait of herself would be great. Immediately she called the world famous portrait painter Rolf Owen. Twice a week, she went. She went his studio. Rolf uh, started painting her portrait. He didn't want to see the picture until it completed. <clears throat> Finally, the portrait was ready. My aunt was very excited and hurried, and the portrait was exactly like my aunt. Unfortunately, she didn't like her portrait and refused to pay. She ordered him to paint again her picture. This time, she didn't visit her studio. After another month, the portrait was ready and my aunt wanted to see it. The face was a beautiful girl. The face was a beautiful girl. It didn't look like my aunt at all, but she loved it. She paid Rolf good amount. Well done. Okay. Thank you, sir. 
next person is mukarram yes sir my aunt camelia is 40 years and very beautiful one day she was looking in the mirror she suddenly decided that to make a portrait of herself and immediately she called the world famous portrait painter rolf unwin twice a week she went to his studio rolf has painted her portrait but she didn't want to see the picture until he completed finally rolf was ready with the portrait my aunt was very excited and hurried to see the portrait and the portrait was exactly like my aunt unfortunately she got angry and refused again she ordered him to make her portrait one more time this time she didn't visit to the studio after a couple of months the portrait was ready and my aunt was ready to see it it was a portrait of a beautiful girl it didn't look like my aunt at all but when she looked at it she loved it and she paid him okay uh sakib you guys have put it in the group yes sakib i completed only three lines sir because i was busy last two days so okay go ahead read okay my aunt camila is an old and very selfish woman one day she was looking in the mirror while looking she suddenly decided that i need a portrait of herself immediately she called the world famous portrait painter rolf twice a week she got his studio rolf painted her picture she didn't want to see the picture until he finished it finally he completed the portrait was ready to see the picture my aunt got the excited portrait, uh, sorry 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 the portrait was ready to see the picture portrait portrait was ready to no no sir portrait take me wait a minute sir portrait was ready to see what should i read right here sir any anything that makes sense to you portrait was ready to give her okay. give the picture hmm. okay my auntie got excited and hurried to see her self in paper the portrait thought auntie will like my art unfortunately she got angry and refused it she ordered him to paint another one okay next person would be sarita aunt camila portrait my aunt camila was old but very beautiful lady uh, one day she saw her face in the mirror and suddenly decided that she wanted a portrait of herself she found out a famous portrait um, famous portrait painter golap unwin visiting card in her bag immediately she called him she got his appointment she was very happy she visited his studio twice a week rolf starts painted her but he didn't want want to see uh, uh, but he didn't want that she saw the picture until it completed finally the portrait was ready my aunt was very excited and hurried to hurried to see the portrait which which exactly looks like my aunt unfortunately she didn't like it and refused to take it 
Lucy ordered him to do it again. This time, my aunt did not visit the studio. After another couple of months, the portrait was uh, after an um, after some couple of months, the portrait was ready, and my aunt went to see it. The face of portrait was a very uh, was a beautiful young girl. It did not look like my aunt at all, but she loved it. She paid Rolf and took the portrait. So, uh, Paisan, first let him finish and then, yes. Paisan, want to read? Sir, actually, I'm uh, in office here and I'm. Uh, no problems. No problems. No problem. There were uh, there were two types of mistakes. Mistakes which were carelessness, like Sarita said, didn't uh, an verb file. Okay, so that is a mistake of carelessness. But then there were mistakes where you guys didn't use your mind, like Sakit. Once I'm not saying in in the whole once. Okay, once Sakit once. You asked me, what should I write? You know, you're telling a story. You know what might have happened. It's your story. You can add a few things from your side. No, not a problem. But you cannot write something that doesn't make sense. The portrait didn't want to see it. Think that was funny. So, Nick Hill. Hello, sir. Everybody has everybody has read their text. Your turn. You read your turn. I I missed sir. I like I listened. To everybody has read their text, and then you now it is your turn. You read your text, your story, Aunt Camilla's oh, story. Uh, I'm all right, but yeah, uh, if my voice is clear, then I can read. It is very clear. Okay, fine. So, let me check if it was in group. Okay, so uh, it is a story of uh, Aunt Camila. So, she was like, uh, she, uh, she is very uh, old and uh, very stubborn. Uh, one day what happened, like, uh, she saw herself in mirror. And suddenly decided that she would make a portrait of herself. Immediately, she decided to call the world famous painter, Rolf Unwin. By luck, she, no, uh, no, uh, she knew her, so she called him and uh, she, she knew him and she called him. So uh, he asked her to visit uh, his uh, studio twice a week. So Rolf painted her portrait, he didn't want aunt to see the picture until it completed. It completed. Finally, after some time, the portrait was ready. My aunt was excited and hurried to see the portrait. The portrait was exactly like my aunt. Unfortunately, she didn't like it and refused to pay. She ordered him to create another portrait of her. This time, she didn't visit to the studio at all. After couples of months, the portrait was, the portrait was ready and my aunt went to see it. The face was of a beautiful girl. It didn't look like my aunt at all, but she loved it and she paid a paid role for a good amount too. Yeah, so that was it. Okay, well done. Everybody has finished. Um, sometimes, you know, when you don't understand a word, Sahil, then you should try to understand that word before you use it. You use the word hurried in the wrong way, Sahil. Uh, sir, yeah. feedback of my story, sir. Um, a couple of mistakes. Yes. And... Uh, It is completed, should be, it was completed. It was completed. Okay, okay, okay. 
yes 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 actually uh, as it is written maybe it was completed it is written i read it it is okay in <laughs> another sorry sir read this line she ordered him uh, see, you are uh, okay see ordered him to create a another proper portrait of her we don't use a and another we just say okay, another okay 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 read the next sentence this time she didn't visit to the studio at all yes this time that time Okay, okay. So I will always use like I visit my home, uh, I visit coaching, or I visit a school, not two, right? Yes. Okay. You were saying something about my sentence. Yes, you use the word hurried in the wrong way. I didn't understand the word hurried. Can you read the sentence that you wrote with hurried? It is in parent, uh, number three, picture number three or four. Hurried. My aunt was excited and hurried. Finally, the yeah. Hurried is not an adjective, my dear. Hurried is a verb here, okay? Okay, so excited. Yeah. Uh, Nikhil, one more. Yes, sir. Read this line. After a couple of months, uh, the portrait was ready. And my aunt went to say it. Do you want to make any corrections here? Portrait was ready and my aunt went to say it. Uh, I'm not able to correct this. Make, put the word A here before couple. After a couple of months. Okay, okay. 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 Now, let me teach you some something called communication skill here. Yes, I know I'm very friendly and you can say that line to me. But just imagine if I was not your teacher here okay. and you had your principal yes, sir. and you had to say the same thing. The principal suggested that come here and you wanted to say the same thing. How would you say it? Slightly formal. I, apolo I will uh, apologize first. Then I'll say... Uh, I'm going to, <laughs> I'll share him my problem, mm. the reason. No, you don't have to. You just want to say, uh, you could simply say, um, I'm sorry, sir, but if you don't mind, can I stay here itself? Okay. That's it. You sounded polite. Yes, sir. And you said the same thing that you wanted to. Yes. Sir. Right. I'm see, uh Sir, if you don't take it as a as disobedience, can I stay here? Yeah. There's so many other ways. With due all respect. With due respect, if you can I can I stay here? Yeah. All right. All right. A couple of a month. Yes, sure. A couple of Okay, months. you are uh, like you are not audible to me, sir. You can go ahead, like uh, no issue. Go ahead to another person. I will come back and join. Uh, my headphone is not working, maybe. Ah, uh, no, no, it's not your net. It's not your headphones. It is the network actually. The network is bad. 
Send some water, it will bring some water. Anybody else wants any um, more feedback? Yeah, yeah sir. fine. Now I can hear you. Thank you. All right. Okay. Okay. I'll. I'm gonna put the story you have written on the screen first of all, and then we are gonna ask the person. Adnan. Yes, sir. Is this you? Which sir? Oh, sorry. I think it is yours. Yes, I I remember seeing it. Go ahead, Adna. Yes, sir. Mine's Read it. It looked like some insects are moving here and there. Uh, nah, it looks like nothing is moving at least. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Go ahead. It looks <laughs> like you are going to MB do MBBS. 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 He's preparing for it. You know, it is his rehearsal. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> he has started with his writing. <laughs> That's why I said I feel like it's like insects. Okay. My aunt Camila is so is eighty years old. Thirty. Adjective. <laughs> Uh, 30 years old. Yes. Okay. And she is so obsessed with herself. One day when she saw herself in the mirror, she thought that she needs a portrait of herself. Fortunately... Excuse me. One day when she saw herself in the mirror, she thought she needs... No, she needed. Needs is the present tense. Yes. Why would you yes, say... She need... So, she needed... She needed a portrait of herself. Okay. Fortunately, he knew about the world famous painter. Okay. She called him and booked the appoint booked a appointment. An appointment. An appointment. Sorry. An appointment for herself. Mm -hmm. And the artist painted the portrait of. Sir, I can't see. Her. Can you please zoom a little bit? Ouch. This is. No, this is the maximum I, we can go now. It's on Telegram. Okay, portrait of... Yes, yeah, sorry. The artist painted the portrait of my aunt, Camila, exactly the same as it should be. As, should, uh, as it should have been painted. Problem with the language, English language. Okay. When she saw the portrait, she didn't believe that it's her portrait. So it was. It's अच्छा देखो अब अब बात कर रहे पास. It is her portrait मतलब क्या हुआ? Like we are talking about. Like it is मतलब हाँ तो it was ना. Yeah. She didn't believe it was her portrait. Okay. okay. So hmm. she told the artist to make the original portrait of herself. This time, uh, sir, here is the. I have wrote it in short print. This time, artist painted the. Portrait of a beautiful young woman because he understood the fact that what is written here? Fact that Aunt Camilla saw herself as a young and beautiful woman. Thirty years is not young. Maybe she wanted to look more young. She wanted to look like a kid or something. Yeah, that's why he painted the Barbie sir. Portrait a Barbie. Sarab. We want my detailed feedback. Then uh, go ahead, read it again. Yes, sir. My aunt Camila was an old and very interesting lady. And one day when she saw herself in the mirror, she got passionate about herself and suddenly she decided to make a portrait of herself from a world famous painter. Immediately, she went to, I think there is, went to a or the, sir, went to the world-famous painter, Rolf Anvil. I, 
Twice a week, she visited his studio. Rolf made her a portrait, and he didn't want her to see the picture until it is totally finished. It was totally finished. Finally, the portrait was ready, and my aunt come aunt was excited and hurried to see the portrait exactly like my aunt. Unfortunately, she didn't like it and refused to accept herself the way she was. She ordered Hey, him. hey, hey, shut up, shut up, shut up. When you said it's she time. hurried to see the portrait, she hurried to see the portrait, this makes, sounds like a complete sentence, doesn't it? Finally, the portrait was ready and my aunt Camila was excited and hurried to see the portrait. Okay, then exactly like my aunt, how does it come here, this expression, this phrase? I mean, what is the connection of, how do you put this there? Doesn't it look like or sound like, you know, something that should not be here or you need to at least put something more maybe to connect it with the uh, portrait? That, that was exactly like my aunt. Which was, oh, no, the relative pronoun is neither now. Uh, hurry to see the portrait, which was exactly like my aunt. Do you realize it, Sarab? Yes, sir. Do you realize that when, when you put which was, then it makes sound, it makes sense that, okay, the portrait was exactly like my aunt. Otherwise, if I say I gave him the, I gave him the chocolate. Uh, Full of cream. I gave him the chocolate. Full of cream. All right. Doesn't matter. Which was full of cream. I gave him the chocolate, which was full of cream. So, okay, the chocolate was full of cream. But if I remove this, which was, and I say I gave him the chocolate yes, full of cream. Tasty. Tasty. Ha, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you for helping me with that example. I gave him the chocolate. Tasty. Yeah. Doesn't make sound right. Which was tasty. I gave him the chocolate, which was tasty. Okay, so sounds better example. Okay, hmm. sounds like a better example that one. You know, I gave him the chocolate, which was delicious. Yes, and if I say I gave him the chocolate, delicious. Doesn't make sense. No, some. But people can uh, how do they can understand the meaning? Here there will be problem. And uh, sometimes you understand the meaning when you say. I water, drink, glass of water. <laughs> okay, people yes. understand the meaning. That's not how we decide what is right. It's not a proper meaning. Mm, yeah. So you have to either put which was or remove exactly like my aunt. Next. Unfortunately, she didn't like it. Unfortunately, she didn't like it. You're not supposed to whisper. Kept herself yeah, the don't. You listening me, sir? Yeah, unfortunately, she didn't like it and re refused to accept herself the way she was. She ordered him to make a beautiful picture. I think this time she ordered him to make a beautiful picture. This time she didn't visit the studio. After another month, the portrait was ready and it wasn't my aunt. It was a beautiful girl. And my aunt liked it very much. And she paid the painter some extra money. So I will suggest, say this to you, that you have written your simple English, which is amazing. Okay. Um, yes, this was the purpose. You guys were supposed to complete the story yes. in your own way. Okay. And you did that. Uh, you used the words from there. Uh, Saurav did a good job because most of our sentence, sentences, except that one, okay, are correct. He has not made any mistakes there. Yeah. So you've done a good job, Saurav. Rakhi, do you want to read yours? Yes. <clears throat> My aunt Camila is a quite old and very rich. One day, she was doing her makeup in the mirror and suddenly decided that she wants to make a portrait of herself. So immediately, she rushed, rushed to the world-famous portrait painter, Rolf Unwin. 
twice a week she went to his studio rolf really worked hard to painted her he didn't want to paint her to paint her rakhi to paint her to paint her he didn't want her to see the picture until it was finished very good finally after a few weeks the portrait was ready my aunt was extremely excited and hurried to see herself in portrait the portrait was fabulous exactly like my aunt unfortunately she didn't like that portrait at all and refused to accept that this is her portrait she ordered they accept that excuse me accept that it was she refused to accept it was her portrait uh, however you guys have everybody underline this uh, her portrait in your text i'm going to talk about it later otherwise i'll forget it okay her portrait her portrait her portrait next underline it because i'm going to talk to you about it hmm. she ordered him to a portrait again this time she didn't visit the studio at all at all after another month the portrait was ready and finally and my aunt was curious to see it the face was a i didn't write that the face was a beautiful girl the face was a girl yeah the face was a beautiful i think, I think i'm i'm doing something the face was a girl the face was a girl sure nikhil no problems okay the face was a girl no the face was a i think the, <laughs> the face was a girl sounds funny na yeah, yeah exactly okay no problems i'll tell you what the correct thing is the face was that of a girl the face was it was that of a beautiful girl the face was that of a beautiful girl. okay that that of a... okay carry on don't worry carry on but it was a face of another girl it hmm. didn't look like my aunt at all however she just loved it she paid rolf uh, she paid rolf double money with happy face all right sarita sarita sorry sir i did not unmute myself no problem uh, my aunt camila is old and very beautiful lady one day she okay. saw excuse me when you say yes. lady then yes. you need to say is an old and very good is an old is an old. very good because listen here is a very very basic sentence sarita yes, he is nice he is nice okay or he is a nice which is correct he is nice he is nice sarita which is correct he is nice she is tall she is a tall which is correct Oh, I'm confused. Oh wow! She's a tall. She's a tall girl. We are always saying she's a tall girl. She's Now a... listen to me. She's listen a to tall. A is an article. Articles are used before nouns. Yes, sir. Articles are normally used before no. nouns. so she is a tall is not good english yes is tall adjective. is an adjective right this chair is heavy right this chair is comfortable yes sir this chair is big this chair is old any adjective that describes that noun but you don't need a or an yes but when you say she is 
girl, tall girl, then you must use a. She is She's a. a so a was used not because of tall, because of girl. She is a girl. She is girl or she is a girl. She is girl. She is a girl. Which is correct? She is girl or she is girl. She is a girl. A girl. A. Why not she is girl? Why not she is girl? Because in English, when we describe what something is or what somebody is, we use article A or N. When we describe what somebody is or what something is, so she is a girl. I am a teacher. So we when are. you describe somebody or something, what they are, what that thing is, then you must use article A. Okay. So she is a girl. tall girl. All right. She is a girl. She is a tall girl. But without girl, she is tall. So now, can you make the correction? Can you make the correction now, Sarita? Yes, sir. My aunt Camilla is an old, is an old and a very beautiful and lady. No, bas ek hi baar. An old and very beautiful lady. And very beautiful lady. Okay, sir. One day she saw her face in the mirror and suddenly decided that she wanted a portrait of herself. Ah, underline this phrase. Underline this phrase. A portrait of herself. Okay, sir. She found out now. a Hmm. Can I go forward? Mm -hmm. She found out a famous portrait painter, Rolly Unwin, visiting card in her bag. Immediately she called him. She got his appointment. She was very happy and uh, she was very happy. She visited his studio twice a week. Rolf starts painted her. Starts कहाँ से है बेटा? ये ये चीज मैंने भी बुकार किया सर. हम्म हम्म. बताने स्टोरी बताते हैं सर कर सकते हैं एक खास जगह पे कर लेते हैं सर प्रेजेंट भी तुमको साथ सकते हैं स्टोरी बता सकते हैं ओके? Okay? Anyways उस जगह पे नहीं इसलिए गलती है. बड़े But... जो काम कर रहे हैं बच्चे गलती राइट? Right? <laughs> बड़े के लिए तो सही राइट? Right? <laughs> तो वैसे इंग्लिश में भी जब आप सीख जाएंगे तो कुछ चीजें गलत नहीं मानी जाएंगे नहीं सीखे तो वही गलती है बट ही डिड नॉट वांट सी सॉ द पिक्चर अंटिल इट कंप्लीटेड ये क्या हुआ ये क्या हुआ दैट्स आई राइट अंडरलाइन सर बट ही डिड नॉट वांट दैट दैट होना चाहिए था यहां पे Underline that sentence. Sorry. Yes, sir. I underlined it. वो नहीं चाहता था कि आंट कमीला पेंटिंग देखें जब तक कि पेंटिंग कंप्लीट ना हो जाए वो नहीं चाहता था कि आंट कमीला पेंटिंग देखें to see the painting he didn't want her to see the painting see the painting until it is finished until it was finished until okay he didn't want her to see sahi tha aapke liye kya seekh line hai he didn't want her to see wo nahi chahta tha ki dekhe he didn't want her to see ab boliye main nahi chahti hu ki aap mujhe criticize kare no sir इंग्लिश में बोले कैसे बोलेंगे मैं नहीं चाहती हूँ कि आप मुझे क्रिटिसाइज करें आई डोंट वॉन्ट आई डोंट आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू टू आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू आई डोंट वॉन्ट यू आई डोंट वॉन्ट यू टू क्रिटिसाइज मी ठीक है अब बोलो मैं मम्मी चाहती है कि मैं शादी कर लू <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
my Very mother true. wants to <laughs> my mother wants to uh, wants to nahi 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 my mother wants to nahi my mother wants to to get mother married. want me to get married yeah my mother wants okay where is this married. noise coming from there is some noise where is this noise coming from from my side sir my neighbor okay. has a pet dog all right okay अब बोले मैं नहीं चाहती कि मेरा नेबर जो है ना उसका कुत्ता जिंदा रहे ये हम लोग बहुत प्रैक्टिस एलिमेंट्री कोर्स में फॉर दिस मैं चाहती हूं कि मेरे बच्चे सफल हों आई आई वांट माय चिल्ड्रन माय चाइल्ड चिल्ड्रन टू सक्सेस टू बी सक्सेसफुल टू बी सक्सेसफुल वो नहीं चाहता था कि आंट कमीला पेंटिंग देखे ही डिड नॉट वांट हेलो वेट हाउ डू यू से मैं चाहता हूँ की मेरे पापा घर जल्दी आए I want my dad uh, to come home. Come, come. But here, my my dad is stop. No, you have this pattern. Want I want to go or I want go. I want to go. I want to go. Yeah. I want to go. I want. Yeah. And I will go. I want to go. Want subject of want I subject of go. I I want to go. I don't want to go. I want you. I don't want to go. I want. Understand? I want my dad to come home. To come home early. Okay. Hmm. Finally, the, finally the portrait was ready. my aunt was very excited and hurried to see the portrait which exactly looks like my aunt hmm okay looked looked like unfortunately she did not like it and refused to take it she ordered him to do it again Hmm. This time, my aunt did not visit the studio. After hmm. another couple of months, hmm. the portrait was ready, and my aunt went to see it. Very good. The face of portrait was a beautiful young girl. Hmm. It did not look like my aunt at hmm. all, but she loved it. She paid Rolf and took the portrait. Very nice. You wrote very very correct English this time. You know, very Aman. good. Aman. Aman. My aunt Camila is an old lady. One day she she saw in in the mirror herself. Suddenly she decided that have a portrait of herself would be great. immediately she called the world famous portrait painter rolf un twice a week she went his studio went to his studio went to his been to his studio bent nahi went 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 here yeah, went went twice a week she went his to his studio rolf started painting her portrait 
he decided he didn't want to see a, her portrait her portrait underline okay. her portrait yeah i have underlined okay he didn't want to see uh, the picture until it completed okay okay, okay. finally the port portrait was ready my aunt my aunt was very excited and hurried and the portrait was exactly like my aunt unfortunately hurried matlab she was in rush. Okay. Carry on. Okay. The portrait was exactly like my aunt. Unfortunately, she didn't like her portrait and refused to pay. She ordered him to paint again her picture. This time, she didn't visit her studio. After what? another month, the, the portrait was ready and my aunt what wanted happened? to see it okay the face was a beautiful girl ah, i'm coming <laughs> okay here is the the face was a beautiful girl it didn't look like my aunt at all but she loved Achha, it when you say this she ordered him to paint again her picture yeah. don't you think it should say ordered him to paint her picture again she ordered him Paint again her picture, paint her picture again. Paint her picture. Paint her picture again. Which makes a better phrase? Paint again, paint her picture again. What is the object of paint? Uh, object of um, her picture. Her picture. So object is usually after the verb. Yeah. Okay. Don't separate the verb and its object. Pop like time time. जैसे एक मास उसके बच्चे को जुदा करने से पाप लगता है वैसे एक वर्ब से उसके ऑब्जेक्ट को जुदा करने से आपको पाप लगेगा इट लुक लाइक माय आंट एट ऑल बट शी लव इट सी पेड रोल ऑफ गुड अमाउंट ओके I have this question here that have a portrait herself would be great in first paragraph. Huh. In second line, the having. Yeah. having having. All right, everybody. Good job. Let's understand. Mukarram has left. Okay. My aunt Camila is 40 years and old. And very beautiful. One day she was looking in the mirror. She suddenly decided that to make a portrait of herself. Nah. She decided that to make nah. She decided. Okay. She called the world famous portrait. Immediately she called the world famous portrait painter Ralph Unwin. Twice a week she went to his studio. Rolf painted not has. You're talking about past. Why the present past? Rolf painted her portrait, but he didn't want to see the picture until he didn't want to see the picture. He didn't want to see. He didn't want her to see. He didn't want her to see the picture until he completed the picture. Finally, Ralph was ready with the portrait. One, one, my aunt was very excited and hurried to see the portrait. And the portrait was exactly like my aunt. Unfortunately, she got angry and refused. Refused. Refused what? Again, she ordered him to make, to make, no, to make, okay, her portrait one more time. This time, she didn't visit the studio. Uh, quite a few mistakes, actually, Mukharram. Um, I'm, I was not expecting all this, honestly. After a couple of months, the portrait was ready, and my aunt was ready to see it. Okay, Mukharram, try and work harder, okay? Notice a small, small thing that I highlight. Okay. Um... I am going to share with you guys the, the story, page number 154. Let's go to page number 154. Uh, 
My aunt Camilla is quite old and very rich indeed. One day she was looking in the mirror when she suddenly decided that she wanted a portrait of herself. Immediately, she booked an appointment with the world-famous portrait painter, Rolf Unwin. Twice a week, she went to his studio. Rolf worked extremely hard and painted her portrait very carefully and secretly. He didn't want my aunt to see the picture until it was completely finished. Finally, after three months, the portrait was ready. My aunt was very excited and hurried to see the hurried to the studio to see it. The portrait was excellent. It looked exactly like my aunt. Unfortunately, she was absolutely furious and refused to pay all. She ordered him to paint it again. This time, my aunt didn't visit the studio at all. After another three months, the portrait was ready and my aunt went to see it. The face was that of a beautiful young girl. In fact, it was Rosgul and Cassandra. And it didn't look like my aunt at all. But of course, she absolutely loved it. She paid Rolf very generously indeed. So she, so he and Cassandra had enough money to get married and they all lived happily ever after. Okay. Um, I know last couple of days I couldn't teach. Um, yes, last night I perhaps told you about this little accident that we had. And uh, so we had some lovely people who helped us. And uh, one of the late people was a girl who offered to go with my wife in, in a stranger's car just to help my wife. She's here. So I would like to go and spend some time with her, you know. So guys, um, I'm wrapping up early. Okay. Um, it was on the highway. It was me and my wife. She had an injury on her head. And she was bleeding. Okay, so it was necessary that she was reached, you know, um, taken to the hospital to the doctor as soon as possible. Um, so because it was me and the bike was in a bad condition too, it was next to imp next to impossible to have my wife on the back of the you know bike and take her to the doctor. So there was another man. He was in his car with his family. So he offered, but the problem was, uh, would my wife go alone? You know. So this girl who was uh, sitting with me, you know, with a guy on the bike, she said, okay, brother, whatever, you know, the guy, you bring the bike. I'm going with this, you know, lady, my wife. So she went into the car with my wife, took her to the doctor, all these people. And uh, so I thought that I should invite her. She's from Barthaligan, you know, and uh, she's staying here with some relative. And tomorrow morning, she's leaving the house. So we decided that we should call her and, you know, uh, you know, appreciate what she did for us, you know, thank her a little bit. There are still lots of good people on the earth. Lots of people. Yeah. Um, my wife was saying exactly that, that, uh, yeah, she's okay, Nikhil. Um, my wife will be fine going back to work in a couple of days. Uh, she had a, a head injury, a little bit of an injury here. Uh, I got a very small injury here and a little bit here. Okay, that's it. But she fell badly, awkwardly, you know, and that's why she got more injured than me. But anyway, an so accident. she. Yeah, Sarita, unfortunately, all, all the fun I had in two days, you know, just disappeared. I'm not thinking about all the great times I had, you know, there in Nevada. I'm just thinking about the accident, which was all my fault, you know. I was not smart, and that's why it happened. Anyways, um, so. Maybe it's good that it's Sunday tomorrow. Mm -hmm. I need a little bit of a break to overcome this feeling that it was because of me. It was because of me. I'm closing my eyes and you know what I'm getting, what I'm seeing right now. I'm seeing myself being, uh, you know, having an accident, um, seeing myself moving very fast. I don't know why. It has happened since morning, you know. Whenever I'm closing my eyes, trying to just think about something, I'm seeing myself traveling at a very good speed. Though yesterday, we were going at 10, 10 kilometers an hour, 15 kilometers an hour. It was very slow. But she fell and she had to get hurt. So um, I hope you guys understand this week wasn't very productive. We'll, we'll try to be, you know, we'll try to make up for this next week. And uh, you have the story there. Match your story, your text with that story text, okay? And all your questions will be answered on Monday, okay? Yeah, no issue, sir. Fine, Take guys. care kindly. 
fine. Thank you. Bye bye. See you. Bye bye. And there's discussion class either. I won't won't be there. Okay. I'll see you guys on Monday. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.